to show you how you can get started using the Ginkgo Master Item Manager and how you can get started installing that extension. So the first thing you'll want to do is you want to access the Quick Management Console and from here you'll want to go to the extensions directory. Um, you'll want to go down to the import button at the bottom and click choose a file and you want to select the file Master Item Manager that you've downloaded from either ClickBranch or GitHub. You can import that extension and then you'll want to go back to a new application. From there you want to go to the script editor and you can create a new section and call it master item import. Next you want to have a data connection that links to the template file. You can find the template file in the extension that you've downloaded from uh, the GitHub page. Um, once you've created a data connection, you want to select data and you'll want to include the scripts for both the dimension and the measures tables and then you can insert script. If you want to enable your partial reloads, you can add a replace load to the load statements and if you wanted to hide the field names on the front end, you can also um, set the hide prefix to percent mi percent, um, but I'm going to just keep that the way it is for now. Uh, once you've done that, you can hit load data, and you'll want to go back to your application. You can create a new sheet, and first you'll want to bring in the master item manager and next you'll want to create two tables. You'll want to create a table for the dimensions and a table for the measures. I would recommend using the quick table viewer for this. Um, this extension was created by Ralph Becker and Christoph Schwartz. Uh, it's highly useful. I would definitely recommend it. Next you'll want to select the table that you want to create. Um, Ignore the columns with the wildcard pattern that include that percent MI, and then hit get my table. And then you'll want to do that for the measures as well. So once you've created the tables for both your dimensions and measures, you can get started using this application. You'll want to know that um, the actions performed by the Ginkgo Master Item Manager only apply to uh, master items that exist in the temp template file, so um, the master item manager is not going to delete um, the master items that you've already created in an application if you're using it in new ones. Um, if you do want to delete the extension, the master items that you already have, you can click the delete all button. Um, also, if you wanted to add the uh, template, uh, template schemas um, from previously made master items, you can click the export measure items uh, in an application uh, that you want to uh, extract basically those uh, existing measure items. Uh, that exists for the dimensions in what as well. Um, so then basically uh, the extension works that you can make a selection on a subset of those measures and then the actions will be performed on those. So if you hit create, um, a prompt will come up and will show you that measures have been created. And if you go back to your master items under measures, you'll see that the measures that were created correspond to the selections uh, from your table. Um, likewise, that exists for deleting and updating. So that's basically all there is to it. So I hope you have fun using this extension. And I hope it's useful for you. Thank you.